Hi everyone, this video is explaining the usage of Microsoft Teams. In order to access the features Microsoft Teams offers us, we have to install this desktop version if it is a computer and the mobile version if it is a mobile phone. So download whichever is required and install it then you will see an icon that you see on the screen now double click on that icon provided you have received your user id and password from the administrator so when you double click on it that will ask for the user id the microsoft id type your user id in this column and click on sign in now give your password if you are accessing this microsoft teams app for the first time after this it will ask for a reset password option so you have to do it this is not the first time I'm using this app using this particular ID so it is not showing an option like that after the successful logging in you'll be getting the teams on your desktop for which you are already a member in this example I'm opening class 12 IP so this is what the interface which you get when you open the team. We are now in the post tab. So here you will see the activities happened. And you want to submit your assignment. Then click on that assignment as you see on the screen it will open the assignment page and select editing in the browser mode and you can type your answer here there is no need of saving it it is automatically getting saved so simply close this window using the button close button that you see on the right hand side top all the options for Microsoft Word are available in this window also so you want to edit and you want to modify your content any type of document editing is possible here and click on close once if you have done see on right side top corner you can see handed in that means we have submitted the assignment now go back to the posts page again this is one way of submitting the assignment now I will show you another way of submitting your answer suppose you have your uh, file uh, your answer as a separate file how can you do it this is the assignment and you can see this assignment is already submitted but for your uh, understanding one more answer we are attaching so this is the way you can upload your file which contains the answer for this particular assignment click on done so that your answer will be attached this answer 
what you type or attach will be accessible only for your teacher and you. No one else in this team can access it. After that, you have to click on the button, hand in. Now, both the assignments are submitted. We will see another option, class notes tab. Class notes is the area where the teacher can share notes with you. So you go to content library as you see on the screen and click on the pages that you see there. These are the pages the teacher is sharing. So you can go through the notes. If you want you can edit and whatever modifications you make will be reflected in your class not alone. These are the two important features and the next feature is chat. If you want to communicate with your teacher, if you want to ask any doubts, then you can do it in this way. And this question, this messages can be only viewed by that corresponding teacher. It's a one-to-one -one communication. Hope this much is clear. So all of you install Microsoft Teams and try to access these features once if you receive the user ID and password from your teacher. Thank you.